Okay, in this segment we're going to talk a little bit about the feet and how to get started there. Uh, I think probably the quickest way is to grab the back part of the heel. We're, we're going to, of the leg, we're going to create the heel first. So uh, we'll just want those um, edges which we're going to extrude down for the heel. So with those uh, selected and I'm going to hold down my shift key and just go ahead and drop that down to the floor. Alright, and then what we're going to do is uh, grab those edges. Key down. And um, also grabbing the edges that are left on the leg. And we're also going to extrude those out. So again, we're going for just really basic shapes to start. It's just best to get the really basic shapes in first and then go for the gusto. So we're going to go out to the end of the foot, but not include the toes. Toes, if you need toes in your character, then um, you can um, create those toes the same way that you created the fingers. But in this particular case, we're going to have shoes on this character, so we don't need the toes. And we'll just go ahead and extrude out again uh, for the toe segment. And I'm going to line those up just really quickly. Alright, so top down view of that. And you can see that we have something to work with here now. And we're just going to go ahead and shape those a little bit with the um, birds selected. So we're getting ooh, what looks like a really long narrow foot. So these are a little bit uh, at an angle. We have to keep, keep that in mind, but uh, we'll go ahead and make sure that we have enough foot here to tell the story that that is a foot. <clears throat> they do flatten out a little bit more on the side. Alright. So, and you can come down here and pull these words down. Just grab this. Um, actually, let's just go ahead and do a bridge. And we're going to put an extra segment in there. And then we'll just come in here and grab this vert and weld it to this one. So we'll select target weld, grab it, drag it over to this one. Alright, you, now you cannot uh, continue to work, otherwise you'll be welding birds all over the place. You have to deselect that tool in order for it to stop working. So, um, go ahead and keep that lined up with the edge loop. And that is the beginning of our foot. And we will continue to detail that out as well uh, when we uh, start throwing in more detail for now. We can um, probably shape up this area just a little bit more. There we go. So, getting to look a little bit more like a foot. Alright, so the next thing we're going to talk about is mirroring our mesh. But first, we're going to put on a neck. If you'd like to see how your mesh is coming along, you can select on poly, go ahead and deselect edge faces, um, right click, uh, deselect see through. And you can see that everything that's been extruded or bridged is faceted. So if you grab all those polygons together, come all the way down to smoothing groups, clear all, select one you'll be able to get a better idea of how your mesh is shaping up. And it's looking halfway decent for such 
such something that's just so low poly. All right. So there's a good view. We'll come back and talk about mirroring the mesh.